Hi guys, it's Paul Baxter here with another video. As you can see, I'm on Westbridge Hills and I'm standing in the main yard. In front of me is the new mod that's just come out today. It's a forage and chip silo. It holds wood chips, grass, hay, straw and silage. So it saves on a lot of bales. The stuff goes in through the back, the same as it would in the hay loft. So I think this will be a very good mod. And it's only it's going to cost 25000 to install it. So I think we'll be using that quite a bit. Right guys, I would like, I've purchased the New Holland and the Pronto sewer. I want to take it up to where the cow shed is and buy the field next to it so that I can turn that into grass. So that I can get some hay off for the, the cows. So we'll head off up there now. By the looks on it, this field has already got something planted in it. Hopefully I'll be able to sow straight over the top. But for set of work out we're doing that because I want to go and buy a harvester and start the canola harvest. So we'll set a work out away now. Jump out of there. Let's have a look. Yes, it's it's brilliant. It's, so that'll be grass in no time. So now I'll skip through to the, the shop. I think we'll buy the the CR 1090. As you can see, I've bought two.
and then we'll, s we'll do this canola harvest here. Set a worker away because I need to buy a trailer, a tractor, and a trailer to collect the harvest. So we'll have to go back to the shop. Um, I think we'll go with the case optimum CVX. We'll soup it up to 300. Trailer wise, we'll have the. I think we'll go with the Agriliner at 30 at 56,000. Not used that trailer for a while. So we'll go and collect those two from the, the shop. Would help if I jump into the right, the right machine. Can't see his torn trailer with a harvester. guys I hope everybody's having a good Wednesday my idea hasn't been too bad uh, we'll just check how the uh, it seems to be getting on quite well with planting the grass I think we'll just do a bit of harvesting for a while. The plan is to get some cows on the, this farm. That's why I'm planting the, the grass up by the cow shed, which it save a lot of lot of travelling with with the grass and the straw. I don't really want to get any sheep on here because in the past they're frozen. Can I just take this opportunity for to ask you to pop over to a few YouTube friends of mine, Terrier930, Smurf12, 
Asbo Gaming, Madhouse Gaming, and Movie Guy Gaming. All very good YouTubers. So you could pop along, give them a like, give them a sub, and let them know that Paul Baxter sent you. I'll be very grateful. I'll leave him to do that and I'll pop back buy another header for this harvester I'm not banging into the wall with the, the header. And then we can start this harvest here. straw sloth on, we can collect the straw and put it into the new forest silo, which would save for bedding for the cows. The music I'm playing today is by NCS non-copyright sounds hope it's not too loud for everybody
just have to stop here guys and go and sort that other harvester out as he must have a full grain tank by now. Something I don't like doing, guys, is running into the crop because it doesn't look realistic. I'll take this down and put it into the silo then I can take the trailer back over to the field where the other harvester is ready to empty him when when he's full this here and jump back in the harvester. And off we go again. Thank you. 
Okay, that'll tell me to go get the trailer. We'll get this harvester offloaded. Hopefully it won't take too long to do this field as I didn't plant this so it hasn't been fertilized. So the yield will not be as good as what the next one will be.
hopefully it won't take too much longer to finish this field off guys and maybe move on to something else we'll have to check to see how the the new Holland is doing on the grass field he should be about finished just going to stop here guys to get this emptied because the the other harvester I'll need it pretty soon on because I'll need his tank emptying too far So we'll go down and carry on with this harvest. As I said, hopefully it shouldn't take too much longer to do this one. Just leave that there.
think what we'll do guys, we'll tip this here. And I think we'll we'll set a worker away, then we'll flick through and see what the the new Holland has done on the grass. As, as I said, he must nearly be finished. So we'll set a worker away and we'll flick through. Uh, I thought he would nearly be finished. So we'll just go up this single track with him and then. Once this is finished showing this field, we could maybe go and pick up a, a forage wagon and start picking that straw, straw sloth up off, off the field. Should get a good amount of bills off this field. Depending on how many there is, you could probably get grass and hay at the same time. Or grass and silage. So that's that field sown. As I said, we'll now take this swore back down to the main farm and maybe go to the shop and pick up a, a forage wagon and start picking the straw swaths up off the field.
put this in here for now. forage wagon which I think we'll go with the Bergman it's as good as one as any Need to empty the trailer, sorry about that guys. What I will have to purchase on this farm is um, seed refill tanks as there's no seed refill point and I'll need a fertiliser tank as well. So I think we'll put them in place once I've emptied this, this harvester. So that when we come to resow the fields that I'm not looking for seeds.
tool as him off load that. And then we'll look for somewhere to put these CD fill tanks. I think here is as good a place as any. So we'll go in the placeables. I think they're along this way somewhere. So we'll spin around and we'll place the seed one there. And the solid fertilizer one if we we'll put that there. But I'm not gonna be looking for them. Right guys, I think I'll call it there. So just once again, if I could ask you, if you could visit a few YouTube friends of mine and drop them a sub, drop them a like on the latest streams and videos. That's Terrier 930, Asbo Gaming, Smurf 12, Madhouse Gaming, and also Movie Guy Gaming. All very good YouTubers. So until ne next time guys, this is Paul Baxter signing out. Bye for now.